Hey guys, and welcome back to Colony Wars. When we last left off, we completed the training. Now, let's jump into the campaign. The Navy was stretched across the star systems, governing and oppressing, then transporting its spoils back to Earth. The League was small and tightly knit, able to hit the Navy hard and quick before disappearing into darkness. But when we heard there was a new threat to Galanaya, our home star system, the whole fleet felt the cold rush of fear. The Battle of Benay had lifted us all, inexperienced as we were, but now the entire system was at stake. This time, our families needed us. This time, we were protecting our homes. Alrighty then. Navy missions within Galanire appear to be increasing. It is feared that protracted military incursions are planned. Intelligence data indicates concentrated targeting of planetary zones. Civilian areas are not excluded. Navy fighters are currently on course for Midas spaceport. Docked civilian transports are believed to be the target. Serious potential civilian damage. Cargo destruction is also likely. The installed defense grid cannot be used due to proximity of civilian craft. Navy incursions within Galanire system are unacceptable. Intercept and destroy all enemy craft. Civilian vessels must be protected. Immediate response required. All right. <clears throat> Fair do. So, sounds like they're knocking on our door, which is unacceptable, as our man here says. Uh, and I have a cat walking across my desk, which is uh, also unacceptable. Come here, you. Yeah. Uh, right, so let's go show these... Uh, Imp oh, I was going to say Imperial scum. Let's go show the Empire that they're not welcome around here. So we have to defend some civilian craft. Shouldn't be too difficult. Couple of enemy fighters. Okay. Alright. First day out on the job. Fresh faced green pilot. Right. Let's go. So, what have we got? We've got some uh, enemy T9 tornadoes. Shouldn't be too much to worry about. Go waste these guys. Who else? What missiles do we have? We've got stun missiles. Stun missiles are awesome. They'll completely knock out the enemy craft. Um, and that's permanent as well. So, once that thing's stunned and padlocked, it's done, son. As you can see, you're not even going to really bother using our anti-shield lasers because there's no real point. Just give them a couple of quick bursts of that. How are we doing, guys? Yeah, you're welcome, Midas. That's Docking good news. Initiated. Let's go rearm. Only a couple of T9 tornadoes. Okay, so it wasn't a very serious attack then. I used to be so blown away by the fact that we could dock in these massive space stations. Now these space stations are supposed to be huge as well. So the first mission took 1 minute 11 seconds. Dude. So the fleet lost 3. Okay. Not too bad, and we're a believer, that's our rank, so we're basically the bottom. But as uh, we continue to win, and... Ooh, we got Attacks new... civilian centers new, are resulting uh, in major fighter. skill shortages throughout Galanire. Scientists and engineering staff are required for urgent interbase transfer. Dedicated staff transport networks now established. Network inspectors within Acheron Zone report potential threats to skilled flight craft technicians in convoy from Midas, destination classified. Enemy cells in vicinity known to favor use of anti-civilian aggression. Oof. This convoy is regarded as a high-risk target. Join the convoy as armed backup. 
You are clear to engage hostile craft. Use absolute aggression. Right. -o. Ensure safe passage for civilians. So, okay, so this is a protection mission. We've got to escort some civvies. And we have the S4 Dark Angel, which is a pretty nice ship, actually. It's certainly a step up from the vampire, and I used to love this ship as well. It looks really cool. Missile pods on the front of it. Really nice. So, let's go kick the empire out of here. Show them that the League aren't fucking around. Enemy presence, huh? So we've got AS missiles, we've got tracker missiles, we've got some stun missiles. Oh, we've got some avalanches, have we? Alright, well, let's go to town. Oh, incoming missile. Shit, you're gone, son. So we've got this guy padlocked. Don't want to waste our missiles just yet. Now, they will destroy your craft really, really fast. So, we do want to be a little bit careful here. If I can use the right lasers. You also want to be careful about hitting your own ships. You can do a crazy amount of damage to them. Stormlords. Right, okay. Stormlords are a little bit stronger. That's fine, we're just going to whittle the... Ah, oh, bloody hell. Out of the way. Yeah, who got him? You got him. Are you sure? That was some really bad aiming there. Let's give him a missile. Let's get those shields down. Really? For some reason that one didn't actually uh, lock on. Come on, baby. He's dust. Track a missile. Right, now tracker missiles um, don't do a huge amount of damage to shields, but they will vaporize hull, so not bad. Is that it, or is there more? Area clear. Mission complete. Nice. Return to base. I think Jump we saved open. all of our friends as well, which is good. We're going to need all those engineers for the coming war. Not bad. Not bad at all. Now you notice you can't save it after every level. Uh, or every mission, I should say. You get, um... Ooh. Ah, right, yeah, so blue, um... Are... Uh, kills that your friends made. So... I destroyed five. And the rest of our fleet <laughs> managed to destroy one. Hmm. Hmm. Hopefully this bodes well for my uh, uh, promotion career. Okay. Cool. Let's go. Yeah, so we have to do a chapter before we Increased can save the Navy game. hostility now resulting in violent outbreaks deep within Galanire system. Oof. All available League resources are recalled in systems defense. Warp hole entry data indicates frequent Navy clusters entering illegally. Uh oh. Enemy personnel count within Galanire is high and ascending. Current prisoner of war holding facilities are inadequate. Large scale POW transfers in progress. Captured assault forces in transport between Proteus and Midas have been subject to intensive Navy scanning signals. Risk of Navy interference is high. Escort this prison bay and supply full response capabilities. These prisoners must not escape. Accept no Navy aggression. You have permission to engage enemy on site. Right, let's go kick the Navy in the nuts. Now this is a fun mission actually. There's a couple of surprises here too. Well actually there's one surprise. <laughs> I do like this one. And we're back in our uh, Dark Angel as well, which is nice. I like this one. It's a very cool early ship because it has twice the laser firepower. Right, let's go. You got it. So we've just got a couple of tornadoes. That's no issue. I like that. We're both attacking the same one. Now, the, the AI 
uh, or your um, friendarinos aren't actually that bad in this game. Right, let's go take this guy down. But then, also, the enemies, the enemy pilots are pretty good. Oof, this is not going overly well. This guy's getting a lot of damage on that ship, but that's fine. Come on, baby. Come on. I got you zeroed in. He's gone. He's dust. Yeah, this is a bit of a shit kicker. They're not going nowhere. Don't you worry about it. Yeah, this is an issue because this thing has a very nasty weapon on it. That's okay. We're equipped with our weapons. We're just going to hit this frigate with everything we have. We're not going to get any of them out. Yeah, we got this. 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 Shields are about to fail. But that frigate is dusted. Look at her go. That's going to cost the Navy. Yeah, that big laser that those frigates have. Oof, they hurt. That's why I was saving all of my missiles, so we can just dump them all straight into that thing. And that's a bit of a gamble on these levels as well. You know, do you use the missiles, smoke them as you, you know, pretty much start, or... Do you save them just in case something nasty comes up later? Right. Oh, this game's got passwords as well. Oh, dude. I remember those. Um, okay. So they lost um, a fleet ship there. Nice. Their first loss. And, uh, yeah. So me and the pilot got one each as well. Not bad. All right. Let's drop a save. And we'll continue. Uh, God damn it. Uh, okay, that'll do. Uh, where's accept? End. Cool. Right, there we go. So there's our first few missions done. But we have plenty more. We're just getting started. Uh... Really? Right, saving data. Done. Cool. Now we can get out of here. Let's go. Lights on the seven planets of Galanaya were extinguished as the invasion threat grew. We even built anti-reflectors over the phosphorus lakes of Acheron. They'd have attracted the Navy like moths to a flame. And somewhere on one of those terrified planets was the father. Watching, waiting, preparing himself and his army for the onslaught. Everyone knew the Earth wanted to take Galania and crush the League forever, but no one knew the Father. In those dangerous times, we trusted a stranger, and he in turn trusted us. Yeah, bit strange that, but <laughs> hey, whatever. Our hey, nice. We've got the Hydra. The consolidation of League activity within Galania is now vital. League Command insists that the Galanire battle platform must be seized from Imperial control to prevent further costly Navy incursions. Intercepted Navy data transmissions indicate imminent transfer of troops and hardware to Galanire. League Command plan to transmit false data from platform in order to prevent this. For this to be achieved, it is imperative that this mission is carried out within a strict time buffer. Damn it. Ensure that battle platform is disabled within the time allocated. Platform shields and sensors must be lowered. Platform must remain undamaged to enable subsequent League assault landing. Right, this one can be a little bit tricky from what I can remember. Let's go. But we've got the Hydra. Hydra is a pretty powerful ship. It's probably... Uh, well, it is one of the most powerful ships we get in this game, and it's uh, got nice... I think it's got three lasers as well, which is really cool. 
Okay, let's go. Oh, I forgot how pretty this level was. Oh god. Right, let's do this. So we've got a thunder child. Let's go strip you down. Come on, dude. You are out. Who's next? Alright, so let's go take out these fighters first, I guess. Ah, yes, we've got the Disabletron weapon. This thing's cool. This thing will disable everything. Ah, and we got the scatter laser too. Scatter laser is awesome. You don't need to worry about your anti shields, uh, anti shield lasers or anything like that. This thing is wicked. Now I like what they did here with the draw distance as well, so obviously to help out the PlayStation's um, CPU and all that shit, um, you have flashing lights off into the distance. Now this scatter laser is amazing, I forgot about that. So you can still technically see the enemies all the way out there, but the game doesn't have to render the full 3D models. Really cool little uh, way of saving performance there. Yep. Right. right. Let's take out this platform. Use your EMP weapons, pilot. Let's go. Now, this shouldn't actually take too much to take out. There we go. This is something that always makes me laugh. That entire battle platform was disabled in seconds. Kind of strange. But okay. I mean, I guess these things aren't as tough as they look. There we go, permanent Battle sensor damage. Well done. Nice, just overloaded Amazing that. A little fighter. Sequence. A little fighter just completely fried that thing's shields and sensors. Yeah, okay. <laughs> sure. Hey, whatever works, I guess. Right. So, continue campaign. Not bad. Hey, and we have been promoted. We're now a freedom fighter. Excellent. Let's keep pushing. Securing control of battle platform is now highest priority. Intelligence data confirms transfer of Navy military hardware to Galanire Zone. The future success of League activities is reliant on maintaining a secure home system in this region. League reinforcement forces are now prepared to attempt a landing on the battle platform. Platform defenses have been disabled, enabling passage for landing parties. Craft technicians are currently confirming completion of pre-flight procedures. Protect all League craft involved in this mission. Assault craft must reach platform. Yeah, this one can be a pain in the ass, but luckily we've got the Hydra. And we are en route to kick some serious ass. At least that's the theory. Because it's it can be quite shocking how quickly they knock those uh, landing craft out. So we need to be fast, very fast. Okay. This is command. Platform defenses are down. Commence second stage of assault. All right, let's go with the scatter gun. Ah, oh, there's that music. Motion missile, AS missile. Motion and AS missiles, okay. Oh my god, it just absolutely devastates. The scatter laser is just incredible. It does uh, overheat pretty quickly, but. No, we're doing pretty well, my dude. Oh god, look at this guy. He's still stuck in the dark ages with his AS laser. Yes, luckily. At least on our heavier fighters, we don't have to worry about that stuff. Oh, see him there, he fired off a flare. I don't know what he said there. That's the last you'll see of this whore. I doubt it, considering when this game came out. Oh, missiles. Ow, that hurts. Oh, God, here we go. Right, let's go. 
So I'm guessing we're losing some APCs here. This one can go badly. If we're not careful. League APC is under attack. By what? By you. Let's see if we can deflect him just a little bit. There's too many. Ah, the already got the shields down. That's bad. Shit. Come on, baby. Come on. Now, you need to be careful of your friend as well, because he will light up the APC if you're not careful. Okay, I think we're clear for now. That doesn't mean it's good. Ah, tornado. I'm opening jump gate. Let's go. Come on, you little fucker. See if we can deflect him. Because this battle platform here is opening that portal. And we need that portal for ourselves. Right, another one coming in. Another tornado. Let's go. Where's my wingman? Don't know what my wingman's doing. Oh, there he is. Now, our capital ship is also firing. But they're very ineffective against fighters. Very ineffective. Oh god, they're coming in now. Still just the one, that's fine. Yes, because as I can understand, small fighters have got their own generators. But I think the capsule ships need like big wormholes and things to travel. I might be wrong about that. I might have to look that up. How are we doing? We're almost there. Now, some of these levels do get really hard. Oh, no. Looks like my wingman's shields are damp. This is command. Assault force has taken control of the battle platform. Nice. Mission complete. Stick that in your pipe and smoke it, you navy bastards. That is quite an early victory. <clears throat> now we just have to hold it. Well, I destroyed nine, and my wingman got one, so he wasn't entirely useless, I suppose. All right, let's continue. Navy activity beyond the Galanire warp hole is increasing. Intelligence reports indicate that bomber operations are being targeted on the battle platform. Uh-oh. Heavy attacks on League Battle Platform forces are now expected by enemy ships traversing warp hole. System security procedures have been placed on an alert footing. Warp hole closure is imminent. Intercept and destroy all enemy craft in platform region. Ensure adequate firepower to cover execution of warp hole closure. Expect significant Navy interference. Yeah, they're not going to want us to close that warp pole. But unfortunately for them, that's too bad. Let's go. We should be okay. We're in our Hydra. This thing is just monstrous. That scatter laser is so overpowered. It's great. I mean, it does overheat pretty quickly. Ah, oh, fuck. Minutes. Really didn't want to do that. We've got fighters coming through the warp hole. Let's give them hell. We're going to be giving them hell, don't you worry. See them break. Alright, let's take out this storm lord. Come on. Come on. There we go. A little bit more. He's dust. Can't believe I just fired that missile off. Must get rid of these storm lords. I have a feeling they're bombers. Again, uh, my knowledge of this game is not what it was. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure these are the big nasty bombers. Come on. Oh, he's giving me some nasty hits. Yeah, because I think they've got lasers turrets behind them. Or is that another craft I'm thinking of? Might be another craft. He's dust. Yeah, alright, heck. Ooh, Navy Cruiser. Large enemy presence has been detected emerging from warp hole. 
This poses a major threat to Galanire platform. Yep. Engage and destroy enemy craft. We're on it. We're on it. Luckily. Luckily. We can disable it. Or we should be able to disable it. There we go. Continue EMP attack to disable permanently. Come on. Let's get a nice bit of charge in that. There we go. Permanent damage. Nice. Now we're just going to waste it with a scatter gun. Actually, we've got the anti shield missiles. At least get some of the shields down. Uh, oh, we got the plasma cannons. Plasma cannons are like the anti ship weapon. Right, shields are gone. Yeah, these plasma cannons do a lot of damage. There we go. Tap the button, don't hold it. That way we can just fire permanently. Oh, she's gone. She went so hard, she blew us away. Dude. Alright, that's cool. Now let's go take out the last few fighters. That was a uh, let's yeah, we will use the scatter gun. I'm under heavy attack. Who's under heavy attack? We we panicking about. Honestly. Can't get the stuff. Right, you. I guess really. Oh, that's an anti shield torpedo. We've got a lot of equipment here. <laughs> This thing comes fully loaded. Probably even got heated massage seats too. He's gone. Ooh, Navy Titan. Nice. Nice. Yeah, that would have been bad if that Titan came through. But luckily... Titan go squish. That is a humongous blow to the Navy. So we've managed to destroy one of their flagships. We've already... This little skirmish of theirs has already cost them quite dearly. Surrounding area clear. Well done. Mission complete. Nice. Come back on board. Yep. Tea and medals all round, I think. Docking sequence. Not a bad victory at all. <laughs> Crush the Titan in the warp hole. Oof, that's fairly savage. Cut the thing in half. Ah, uh, we lost a pilot. We lost one of our own. <laughs> no! But then, you know, they lost... Um, what was that? Was it a frigate they lost? They lost seven fighters. Uh, uh, we'll take that. That's not bad. Now, unfortunately, the Navy is significantly bigger than we are. Okay. Does it really ask you to name this every single time? I guess so. Right. It had been a baptism by fire for the League's fleet. But now we'd tasted victory, and it was a flavor we liked. <laughs> Though even in the midst of all that joy, there was bitter resentment against the Tsar. He tried to tear apart our homes, and we knew he'd only failed because his forces were spread too thinly. Perhaps he didn't quite expect the guts and passion that the League delivered, but now he knew what we were capable of. He would undoubtedly try again. Unless, of course, we got him first. Mm-hmm. Right. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave that for the next video. So, thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.